on our second part of our Money Monday segment this morning. We're going to be taking a quick look at what's happening with the stock market, but we're mainly going to be focusing on some of those things you can avoid, those fees when you're out traveling. President and CEO of Great Lakes Credit Union, David Seeger, joins us now with those. David. Good morning. Oh, man. So uh, we're talking qu quickly about the national debt because that is something we're always following. Oh, most definitely. We're looking at $17.5 trillion. Mm -hmm. That's our national debt right now, increasing at the tune of $22,000 per second. Unbelievable. So we really have to watch we every do. penny that we have. Exactly. Now, in terms of trying to save some money, mm -hmm. uh, there's a few things we can do. There's some fees you have to pay, but there's some fees you can avoid. And here okay. we go with some of them. ATM fees. The average is two sixty for a non-bank customer. Okay. Or dollar fifty three plus your own bank charge. Almost four dollars. The solution is to download your uh, bank's ATM locator mm -hmm. and look for an ATM of your bank nearby. Okay. Travel agent fees. About a quarter of the public, traveling public, still use a travel really? agent. Yes. Wow. And at the average cost to, uh, to the ticket is about $25. To avoid if those you're fees. still using a travel agent, you can call me. I'll book you a flight. There you go. So uh, twenty-five dollars, <laughs> and you can put your book online. Yeah. And texting fees. Uh, if you if your plan does not have um, a texting option, mm -hmm. you can use WhatsApp or Viber, and they run over Wi-Fi, and it's totally free. It's do the same type of Pretty thing. Pretty cool. Check bag fees on airlines. Oof. Twenty-five dollars so each yes. way. Okay, many airlines offer a branded airline credit card okay. where they waive the fee if you have it. So oh. it makes a lot of sense to do that. I know we have that so as well. So you don't necessarily have to spend money on the credit card, but it helps you avoid that fee. It certainly does. Okay. Checking account fees, only 38% of banks offer uh, totally free checking. Mm -hmm. Ask them if you would make a direct deposit or have a minimum balance. Maybe you could waive a fee that way. All right. And gift card fees. The average gift card fee is three ninety five, dollars And also there's some dormant fees involved with it as well. Possibly you just go ahead and get, get a retail a specific gift card, maybe the smart thing to do, yeah. avoid all the fees. And they're free yes, most they of are. the time. All right. right. Thanks so much, David. All right.